Youngstown has a special place in the history of American art. The Butler Institute of American Art was founded in 1919 by Joseph G. Butler Jr. and is the first art museum exclusively dedicated to American art. The public museum ensures that anyone can view some of the best American art that is located here in the heart of Youngstown on Wick Avenue. The Butler Institute of American Art is home to 20,000 pieces ranging from the world famous Norman Rockwell to some of Youngstown's local artists. In Flanders Field is an American Impressionistic painting done by artist Robert Vano in 1890. It was purchased by Joseph Butler in 1919 and is a part of the Butler's permanent collection. Lincoln the Rail Splitter by Norman Rockwell was purchased by the Butler in 2006 at an auction held by Christie's in New York. Dr. Zona, the director of the Butler, has said that given the fact that the Butler is our country's first museum of American art, this masterpiece by one of the greatest of American artists is a most perfect addition. Among the most celebrated works in the Butler's permanent collection is Winslow Homer's Snap the Whip. Painted in 1872, Snap the Whip has been the Butler's prized possession since 1918. The Butler is free to the public and receives no revenues from the city or county. The museum solely relies on contributions from the community and nation to meet its cultural mission. The unique culture of any city is not something that can be defined on paper. It is something that can be observed by the people and its traditions, its history, its architecture, and its art. When you think of Youngstown, you may not think of beautiful paintings, you think instead of blistered hands, broken backs, smokestacks, and a staggering crime rate. But it has more redeeming qualities than meets the eye or a statistics book. The art of Youngstown can not only be seen formally in museums, but it can also be seen in various murals and sculptures that make Youngstown such a unique city.